Let's talk justice and charity. Hello, I'm Deacon Mike, also known by some as Deacon Dad. In today's 1% Challenge, we're going to briefly reflect on the book of Isaiah, chapter 58, verses 9 to 12. Let's begin with prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, amen. Come, Holy Spirit, reveal to us exactly what you want, nothing more and nothing less, amen. Then you shall call, and the Lord will answer. You shall cry for help, and he will say, Here I am. If you remove the yoke from among you, the accusing finger and the malicious speech, if you lavish your food on the hungry and satisfy the afflicted, then your light shall rise in the darkness, and your gloom shall become like midday. Then the Lord will guide you always and satisfy your thirst in parched places, will give strength to your bones, and you shall be like a watered garden, like a flowering spring whose waters never fail. Your people shall rebuild the ancient ruins, the foundations from ages past you shall raise up. Repair of the breach, they shall call you, restorer of the ruined dwellings. In this reflection from Isaiah, what is God calling each of us to do? How do the works of mercy in Isaiah chapter 58 echo Jesus' discourse on the last judgment in Matthew chapter 25? In today's reflection from Isaiah, God is telling his people that he will listen to those prayers accompanied by acts of justice and charity. How often do we ask God to answer our prayers but forget to love our neighbor. Are we that different from the Israelites in Isaiah's time? If you enjoyed today's 1% challenge, be sure to like and share this video so that we can spread the good news of the Lord Jesus to more souls. Thank you all for joining me today, and may God bless you.